Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a small bit of a haul for you, or a pretty big haul actually. I have been looking at some stuff with the like winter sales and stuff like that um, and stuff I have been looking at for a while and it was all on like saved lists, lists and everything and then with Christmas money I decided to go ahead and get it. So I did also buy two swimsuits from Cupshe but I think I'm going to do like a separate haul review try on of those because I know they can be hit and miss and I think the styles that I got are super cute and a lot of people might look at them. So I'll just hop right in. I'm going to start with the stuff I got from ASOS because my dog is asleep on the other stuff. So if I didn't say before, the stuff is from ASOS and Forever 21. So starting off with the small stuff, I got this headband. Very cute, very sequin. <laughs> but can you tell I just finished watching Gossip Girl? Um, I like had started and stopped a couple of times, but I love it so much. It's, I, the only reason I stopped is that I honestly like didn't have time. Um, so yeah, I bought a very sequined headband, but I wear them whenever my hair is straight, so it's pretty cute. If I also didn't say, everything I bought from ASOS was on sale. These four things, I think. So I, it's just my dog. <laughs> um, I bought these Christmas decorations because they don't jump off the bed. Sorry, my dog's trying to jump off the bed. Um, and they are from Paper Chase, but I bought them through ASOS and they were only three euro, which is pretty good, or like three euro 30 cents. So this has Merry and Bright and it's cactus. They're like tropical themed Christmas decorations and oh, these are hooked around, but flamingo and pineapple. I thought they were pretty cute and good for three euro. If I ever have like my own tree, I can put those up because I love tropical things. So then the other two things I got were actual clothing items and oops, I have them on hangers. So leave a comment below if you see this my dog is being so annoying right now. The same like similarities uh, that I did. So I saw this top. Cute yellow ruffly top. And then I, well, I was like, it seemed kind of familiar. Did I have something like that when I was younger? I don't know and I thought about it and I was like no I don't I think I just really like things this style it's kind of like a peplum style but kind of drops at the edges as well if you can see it's really cute on it's quite low but it's just so flattering can you stop and it's got like the little divided bit at the back but it is it's not like an open back it's not um it's not an open back yes I said it's all closed in and the straps are kind of wide but because of where they are you would still have to wear like a strapless bra with it but then I tried it on and I was like, oh my god, I look like Alison from Pretty Little Liars the night she went missing. <laughs> so this is always going to be my Alison top. I think it's so funny um, that that's what I thought of, but it's true. If you've ever seen Pretty Little Liars or just Google it, maybe I'll insert a picture here. But yeah, maybe that's why I liked it so much. I was a diehard fan, still am. So, And then the last thing that I got from ASOS is this super cute Look at that, it's like a linen material. I had to get it in A12 because I'm usually like a 10-12 and they sold out of 10s. So I just got it in a 12 and it actually fits fine. I can be up to a size 14 in skirts and down to a size, a lot of the time I'm an 8 in tops and I can go down to a 6. So that's just sizing for you. And yeah, it's super cute. It has a zip at the back so I could it would be like easier for me to take it in at the waist if I needed to. But it's got this cute little ruffle detail along the edge and again a little bit Gossip Girl inspired to think maybe. So my dog has just like moved her butt over here so we can start with the Forever 21 stuff. So I got one other thing from Forever 21 that I'm not going to show because I'm going to return it. It was just a maxi skirt. Nothing wrong with the skirt itself. It just doesn't look good on me because I'm 5'2 and as I said before with the other skirt I have very wide hips so it was just, it was not good. Um, But this blouse is so I got this blouse as well. This was, I'm pretty sure this is new stock. So it was 20 euro, but I knew I loved it and I would actually wear it a lot. So I thought it was totally worth it. It's a little bit cropped, which I think is kind of strange. I think Forever 21 sometimes need to stop like cropping everything and be like, okay, think of the kind of girl who's going to wear a white ruffly blouse. It's not typically the same kind of girl who wears crop tops. Not being judgmental, like there's nothing wrong with wearing crop tops, but if you like your particular style, it's unusual that they both align. Do you know what I mean? Anyways, it's cute, but wish it wasn't as short as it is. Maybe it'll be really easy to wear for me because it'll be short, but 
I don't know. It's cute though. So the other thing I got from Forever 21, which is very unusual for me, um, it's just not a very me item, but I did get it for um, volunteering overseas. And that is these pants. They are big, flowy pants, but they have a cute little panel detail at the front. And these are, again, I think these are new stock. Um, they were 24 euro. I think mine were 18. Maybe they were on sale. But these are super cute. The only thing is, so they're super long. That's easy to cut off, but it's only... I don't typically wear things like this. It's just that I need something loose fitting and long enough, yet cool enough when I'm traveling because I don't have shorts that long and I know it's gonna be a problem for me to find them. So yeah, I think these are super cute. Like you could totally wear them as just a fashion item. They're so comfortable. Um, the only thing is that, I don't know if you can hear that. These these little things at the end, I'm just gonna cut them off, be grand. So I also got some accessories from Forever 21 because everyone knows their accessories are so inexpensive. So first I got this necklace and the chain keeps getting caught and it is one of the little sideways cross necklaces and I had been looking at one like this from Dog Eared, if you know that brand. I'm trying to get this to balance, there you go. So cute. Um, I had been looking at one from Dog Eared but they stopped making them I think. The one with the faith one, and it's much more dainty. But this was three euro, so it's pretty good. It's better than like sixty. And lastly, I got this tote bag, which just has lots of world cities on it, and I thought it was really cute. These are only four euro. I don't know what that is in dollars. Um, and they're just so handy, like for college, if you need to just throw some stuff in a bag. I know I'll be using this for a dance probably, because I always forget a dance bag. And I think the colorful foil is pretty good and Dublin's on it. Hey! That's where I go to school. So that is it from Forever 21. So the very last thing is something my mom actually picked up for me from H&M because it was way on sale. It was seven euro but it is this again yellow. I don't know why I'm going with the yellow. Um, Kind of flowy tank top and it has like a little bit of a ruffle collar and I think that's why she got it for me because she knows I love ruffle collars. Um, this is just a good go-to, like throw on for college, throw cardigan on over it, you're dressed. Because I always oversleep. So this will be getting a lot of use. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this haul. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments down below. Uh, I'm sick right now and I just got two vaccinations um, earlier today, which I'll be posting a video about. Um, it's to do with the mission trip I'm going to be going on. It's kind of a mission trip. It's kind of just humanitarian aid. And yeah, I think I'm starting to feel it now because I feel awful. So just hit me in the last few minutes. So that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please do subscribe to my channel. I have a lot of exciting things coming up in the next few months and especially over the summer. So you would probably want to stick around to see that and I'll see you in my next video.